Hey guys, it's Fuli and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing another AliExpress haul for you. And of course, if you like this type of video, don't forget to click the like button. It really helps with the algorithm on YouTube for me. And also, um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. And also, don't forget to click the subscribe button and then bell notification button so you kind of get all the notifications of when I actually post. Um, I will be trying to do more journal with me videos. I just kind of have to get my craft room situated. Um, but if you want to see, you know, how I use all the stuff that I haul from, you know, AliExpress, you know, do check out my Instagram, at The Boot Life. I do post a lot of my layouts on there, so then, you know, you guys can kind of have an idea on um, how maybe you guys would like to incorporate all this stuff into your journals, into your planners. But yeah, it's it's really fun. It's it's very relaxing time. <laughs> so today we're going to be, uh, or I'm going to be, showing you guys uh, some things I got from, I think, three stores. So yeah, let me just go ahead and get started. The first store that I'm, I got the stuff from is from House of Novelty Official Store. So I shop from them um, quite a bit. I do like their customer service. Most of the stuff I get usually comes in about... Uh, three weeks to a month so do understand like all the stuff from Aliexpress they are being shipped from overseas to in chi from China I think sometimes there's options for you to ship from the US but then the shipping fee is insane so just be patient <laughs> you know it's kind of like a surprise like a present you just don't know when it comes in and when you get it it's like early Christmas <laughs> so um, let's go ahead and I'll show you some of the stuff that I haul from House of Novelty official store. I will start off with these four stickers, sticker packs. So yeah, these three. I think. Well, they. I was. I bought them individually. They didn't come. They weren't in the same page as you would. You know, when you buy something like there's multiple selections. I think these had their own. So like their own page. So the first one I'm gonna show you is just this kawaii rice <laughs> emoji. I guess. Yeah, the stickers. <laughs> and these are by Candy Poetry. So that's the front. And this is the back. So I'll just take it out and then I'll do a quick uh, flip through or scan through or whatever of what they look like. I thought these were cute because uh, if you guys didn't know, I am Taiwanese and I love my rice. <laughs> so I just gotta have these stickers. So let me just go ahead and show you guys some close-ups. So I'm just gonna go through these pretty quick just because we do have quite a bit of things to go through. It's a little bento box. <laughs> just these, the faces on these rice balls are so funny. But yeah, usually I don't know what the um, the the letters are saying because these are Japanese. So most like most of the times I will probably cut these out to put in my journal just because I yeah I don't know what it says. So I'm sorry. <laughs> but of course, if you guys are Japanese and can read uh, Japanese, um, yeah, you guys could please you know let me know what it actually means so um, I don't have to cut them out. Oh, this one's so cute. It's a winking rice ball. I love egg with rice. It's my one of my favorites. Some sushi. Ooh, I love Japanese curry. Okay, so that's that for the little rice ball. I'm just gonna call this little rice ball, which is still not a ball, but okay, little rice friend. How about that? There's that. And then the next one I'm going to show you is this hamster. I think this one's also by Candy Poetry. So let's go ahead and take a look. And you get about 45 stickers in each of these little packs. And usually when you get stickers like these, they're actually very cheap. Like maybe like 85 cents. Some even cheaper. Just make sure, you know, you guys, you know, browse through the other selections, like by other stores. Some stores will have it cheaper than others. And definitely, you know, see um, if they're shipping or not. But yeah, these are just really cute hamster drawings. Oh, look at this one. Very perfect for Valentine's. <laughs> cute. Oh, 
comforting each other. Is he wearing a ring or bracelet? That's cute. Okay, there's that. Some more Valentine's decorations. Aw, this is so me. I love my little journals and diaries. It's like, ser like seriously though, I don't even remember buying this one. <laughs> I guess this one has to do a lot about like, um, well definitely uh, emotions has to do with two uh, characters instead of one. And a lot of Valentines, I think. Oh, this one's brushing his teeth. Perfect for me. Oh, picnic. Super cute. Okay, so there's the hamster one. Okay, I'll just put it on the side for now. So the next one I'm going to show you one is this one. Um, Hug Hug. I think that's the character's name. It's also by, uh, I think, Candy Poetry. And I really like this one when I saw it. Just because a lot of the emotions, he's like angry, I think. Or needing a hug. or Something like that. I don't remember. I just remember I really liked this one. I wanted it. Super cute. <laughs> so angry. I think I liked it because there was a lot of angry ones, I think. <laughs> Aww. And it's so cute. Oh, I love this. Aww. They're wrestling. Yeah, I know like one of my friends uh, would really like this too, so I'm gonna give her some of these stickers. So cute. Okay, so that's that for Hug Hug stickers. Alright, the last of the the box sticker packs. Um, this one is by Mocard. And this is just kind of like forest themed. So let's see what's inside. Oh, yeah, I think I bought this because they had like foxes and stuff. I love foxes. Yeah, so it's like a fall themed. Bears, mushrooms, squirrels, hedgehog, cute, and then a little deer. So yeah, very cool pieces to make your layouts. I think, yeah, there's a lot of animals in this pack, which I love. Super cute. Yeah, I would say usually um, with these stickers, they have a very wide border like white border so I will actually trim the white border down so it looks a little bit better when you put in your journal or your planner okay so that's that pack all right so the next few things I'm going to show you that I got from house of novelty stores are I think that's it are these two um, character stickers so there was a lot more and I I think that they're from two different pages with like other characters on it and these two are my favorite so let's go ahead and show you this one first and th these two are also by candy poetry so you kind of see the back a little bit so I think there are about 40 stickers 40 pieces So the first one, I, I really liked it just because she has blue hair, bluish gray hair. Whoopsie. I have bought other characters before and that they have been blonde or black hair. So I wanted to get something a little different. And I thought she was super adorable. Yeah, so these are all like washi uh, styled stickers. Oop, they are very slippery. <laughs> okay, so let me just quickly go through it. Super cute. So it seems like you get two copies of each design. I like how they also comes with like um, 
a friend with each pack. Super cute. Okay, so that's that for the blue hair kitty girl. So the next one is this one. Um, this is the blonde hair girl. I just really liked it because she has like a lot of costume stickers where she's wearing costumes. So it's not just emotions, but actually like just different outfits and stuff like that. And I thought that was super cute. Okay, so let's go ahead and go through it together. So she's kind of like a fox girl with the two tail. See? Her little outfit for Halloween. Super cute. I love these. And like I said, I like foxes. <laughs> Happy birthday one. I think this one has like all the different seasons. It's also really cool too. Very cute. Okay, so continuing with character stickers, I also bought these two Korean diary stickers. And let's go ahead and open this one. I think this is like the same character as that one. I don't know, let's see. What is it by? These two are also by... Mm, sorry, I can't, I don't really know what brand this is, but I feel like this is like the same character. Kind of? Well, let's see if she has one tail or two tails. I think that it will probably tell us but it seems like it's another fox girl sticker. So these, uh, this comes with six sheets. And usually these diary stickers are actually very, um, very affordable, very cheap. Actually, I should probably put it right here. There you go. Super cute. I love how he has a little cat friend. Oh, I think it's the same girl. Two tails. So it's probably the same character. So there's that one. This is the second page. Okay. Third page. Fourth page. Fifth page. last page super cute really like it I love these diary stickers but I feel like I don't use them enough I used to use it in my monthly um, my monthly planner kind of I guess it's still like a journaling thing but I feel like I already have um, a planner where I write everything down on the monthly section and that's actually what I want to keep forever. So this, I stopped doing the whole decorating the monthly section. But I will find another use for these stickers. So the next one I bought, I think this is more like a couple one. It's also two fox or cat. Oh, I think they're cats. Yeah, cat people. But it's a couple one. 
do this. So you also get six sticker sheets. So definitely worth the money. I think it's like only a dollar, like a dollar twenty or something. That's the first page. This is the second page. So they have emotions both for the girl and the boy. And this is still the boy, I think. And this is the girl. Oh wait, this is a girl. Wait, what? <laughs> so there's... I am so confused. Is that a boy or a girl? Yeah, you know what? I'm sorry. It is a different character. Which is nothing wrong if it was the same character, like the same sex, but I was just so confused. So there is three characters in here. There's the boy, the girl, and then also another girl, which is uh, kind of, they're both like the tannish cat, I guess. But the reason why I saw the difference is because of the tail. You see how this one is big and fluffy? And then this one um, is very a lot smaller and doesn't have that white tip. Okay, I'm I don't I guess there's three characters in this sticker set, so there's that. <laughs> and then the last I, I'm I don't even know where I left off, but oh, yeah, whatever. Okay, so this is the last page <laughs> of that set, and then I'm pretty sure this is the boy and the girl. Okay, so I didn't know that, but it's a surprise, and now I get more uh, different characters. Yay. Yay for me. Okay, so let me put that away. So the next sticker uh, set I'm, I'm going to show you is this kind of like galaxy shadow or galaxy filled animal shapes. Yeah. Interstellar fantasy. So cool. So pretty much it's this. And it has six sticker sheets. So I thought this one was really pretty because it has a lot of different animals. <coughs> Excuse me. And then it has um, like space backgrounds um, that fills that uh, fills the characters in or fills the animal in. So I thought it was super pretty. So it also comes with six pages, and this is the first one. So it has all these different animals: deer, um, deers, wolf, butterfly, cats. I love how there's a lot of variety. Even eagles, unicorn, and a dog. So cute. The third one. I really like the set. So pretty because I love anything space themed. These are like origami birds, like the geomet the geometric shaped birds. Oh, two doggy, you can tell those are two puppies. Very cute. There's even a lion too. And then this is the last page. Very nice. I really like this set. Okay, so the last of the stickers is this deco sticker. It's kind of just like home um like house plants yeah house house plants and this is by i don't know deco sticker i don't know oh infill me so let me take it out and there's 20 designs and two copies of each so for all you plant ladies out there or plant gentlemen these are probably a must-have because if you guys own one plant or if you guys like plants most likely you guys are a hoarder <laughs> of plants <laughs> like myself so okay I think that's a monsteria super cute very pretty I love these because these these can go pretty much anywhere in your layout they're very neutral so and who doesn't love plant stickers Oopsie, I'm just dropping everything. What did I drop? Oh god, dropping more stuff. Okay, I'll just show you whatever's on my hand. 
But yeah, super cute, very uh, soft looking. It's also uh, made out of the washi tape, fabric, sticker, whatever. Another one on the shelf. And then propagating a leaf. What else did I miss over here? Oh, these are the dollar plants, I think. I forgot the actual name of it. Okay, and I think that's it. So we're done with the stickers, and then the last four items, they're all stamps. And they're, the next stamp is um, this one by Mocard. It's a really big stamp. And this one is by, or I bought it from, Crucial Family Store, which is also another store that I shop um, fairly often with. So I just got one of these since this was a little pricey because of how big the stamp is. So this is by Mocard and it's just kind of like with the, the cotton plant and then a little background. So that's what it looks like. Oh yeah. So usually when, for all the newbies here, usually when I do have stamps or like the long washi, I have my trusty little black notebook, which I stamp so we can see, um, I feel like I don't want this to be on this page. Oh well. Yeah, usually I do that. I stamp it here so... There we go. So it's not so distracting. Um, I stamp it in this notebook so we get to see the quality of the stamps and also the quality of the washi. And also whenever I stamp, I always use my VersaFine Black Onyx ink. Oops, sorry, got myself mixed. Okay, so this stamp also comes with the white rubber which is very uh, well known for, you know, Mocard. That company so let's go ahead and ink this up and see how it looks I'm just gonna put it right here very nice and for all the people who are new to my channel um, I really like this type of foam this white foam that that, that usually all the stamps have um, from Aliexpress just because they are very firm so that means if you put uh, heavier pressure you're not gonna warp the image because this, the rubber basically like flares out so that's why I really like this I love the foam yeah the the really firm foam but let me show you but yeah look at all that detailing especially on the lines on the on the cotton super cute Okay, so I have four more items left, and these three are from, okay, I'm going to butcher the name. These three stamps are from Escola and Oficina Supply Store. <laughs> if you guys actually know the store, or if you guys don't know the store, don't worry. I'm just going to hopefully find the link to where I bought these from, and then I'll have it in the uh, description down at the bottom. So these ones, um, I, just, I chose these three uh, botanical stamps, and they are by Mocard. Because I keep seeing a bunch of stamps with this plant on it, and then I haven't got it. So I'm just going to go ahead and take it out. So I'll stamp all three, and then I'll show you guys how it looks up close. And of course, same thing. This is the nice stamps um, with the white rubber. And the color of the, the image on the top is actually green, so that's really nice. Okay, so let's go ahead and stamp it up. I love it. Oops. Got it on my nails too. I think I pressed too hard. Let's do it one more time. <laughs> I am not even right now. What's going on? Okay, last try. So, don't worry guys. This is not from the stamp. This is definitely user errors. So, excuse me. There we go. Much better. I kind of still shaked a little bit at the end. So here's a close-up of the stamps. 
I just love these stamps. They're just so crisp. They don't have that much detail in them, but then I just love how sharp the lines are. Yeah, so these two I messed up, so excuse that. <laughs> but I really like that one. All right. So that's pretty much it for today's haul. And then, of course, you know, thank you guys for watching. And click the like button if you liked it. And, of course, subscribe again. And click the bell notification button. And, of course, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.